everyone and welcome to another video in today's video we are going to unbox this mystery box that it took forever to get to me but this is a wayne goss mystery box from beautylish site and um unfortunately there's been some problem with the shipping i was supposed to get it like three weeks ago but it took this long but here we are we're gonna unbox this i'm pretty sure you've seen already a bunch of videos of this one but uh, if you haven't hi my name is cosmina and welcome to my channel thank you so much for stopping by when i paid 105 dollars for this um box i don't have much from wayne guys i only have like two lipsticks a lip liner and a lip gloss from him so i'm excited to see what's in here and see what uh what i got i already opened it but i didn't look inside i opened it because the top you can see my address and excuse me i don't really want you to know my address okay so now let's get into this and see what i got okay let's uh let's take the top part off beautiful is usually usually they uh send you some uh, um samples every so often or i mean with ed every purchase that you make and i don't know what this is okay so it says it's a perfect hair shampoo television i guess i don't i don't understand and perfect hair conditioner it says camera ready hair in two steps this is do it all duo gives you have everything you need for perfect hair, body shine, strength, softness, and silky smooth feel. Okay, so I'm going to give this a try and see how that's going to go. But we're not here for that. We're here to look into this mystery box. Just so you know, I did order a another thing in here. So we're going to see if it's... Oh, wait, there you go. It's right on top. This is the RACMA Beauty, the five-part Siri Favorites Palette. And uh, I was really curious about it. I've seen a lot of people really raving about their products, especially Tati and that foundation. But mostly, i always been interested to get one of these and just kind of see what's the, the fuss about it. And this is how this one looks like. Let's see what it says on it. And... It says it's made easy. You can combine it with a lot of other foundation to reach the color that you need. So that's why pretty much I got it. But we're going to talk about this in a different video a little bit longer. Now let's go and have a look in here. And I see a lot of liners. Wow, whoa, what the heck? <laughs> How many liners do we have? Any? One, two, three, four, five of them whoa okay let me take all of these out okay so we have three lip liners two uh coal liners and i have them swatch over here for you so the first one it is in mauve the second one it is in natural medium i think let me make sure because i don't remember all the names but this one it is natural berry and then the last one it is in medium nude so natural berry is going to be the second one the medium nude is going to be the third one and the coal liners the one is rich hazel which is kind of like a really dark brown and then the other one is obsidian and that is a black okay interesting i'm 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 actually glad about these the lip liner that i have is in sepia so i'm glad it's not in here and it's not a repeat okay we have two lip product i think a lipstick and this is a is this the oh yeah this is the gloss oh hibiscus i already have it oh damn okay and then we have a lipstick in walnut i'm gonna take them out and show you at the end but then we have wow two more things in here by the way i forgot to say that i grabbed the medium box it was a light medium and dark you could have choose it which way was better for your skin it was funny because i looked at some of the unboxings and i've seen people that were way lighter than i am and grab the medium i don't understand why but yeah so let's um open these two and see how they look like okay so here's the swatch for the lipstick that is a really beautiful lipstick 
that's gonna look really nice and here's the hibiscus uh swatch i use mine because i keep this one maybe i'm gonna give it to somebody else um because i already have it so this is how it looks like that's how it looks like and this is how the lipstick looks like and i'm gonna take it out so you can see inside but yeah it's a really nice beautiful nude color i like it i like it a lot and i like his lipsticks i tried them i like the lip liners as well i tried them they're very nice and uh, really hydrating on the lips now let's get into these two and open them up so we'll see what are the last two i uh the last two products that i got in this mystery box all right, so the last two products were an eyeshadow palette that is in Imperial Topaz and a bronzer that is in Satin Browns. And this is the swatch right here for the bronzer. I don't know, should I have went with the dark one? Is this too light for me? I don't know. I think I can use it. I think I can make it work for me. But these are the products that I got, $105 for all these products. I think it's really worth it, considering that um, his, uh, his makeup is not necessarily the most affordable one. I think these ones are going for like, for like 50 something dollars. I'm going to put all the prices on the uh, screen for you to see how much they are. But I'm pretty sure this was a really good deal and I'm really excited to start trying them. Um, mostly I'm very excited to try this eyeshadow palette because I have not tried and I heard so many good things about it. But also that bronzer. So this is what I got. Let me know what do you think. Let me know down below and let me know if you're interested to see a video about that RCMA um, makeup what well, i guess is like a foundation palette all right thank you so much for watching and i cannot wait to see all next time with another video have a nice one bye